Hey guys, thanks again for tuning in to Grooming by Rudy. Had an opportunity to show you something here. Uh, we noticed that in starting our prep on this little dog here that she's got very uh, irritated pads. Uh, her pads are just irritated. You can see all that, that reddish fur. That's due to her biting and, and licking it because obviously it's the moisture has built up in there and it's causing the pad to be irritated. Uh, could be a number of things, could be just, you know, salt on the ground, could be an allergy, uh, regardless of what it is. Um, what we want to do to at least help give her some temporary relief right now is we're going we're gonna to do that pad and get all that hair out of there. Uh, we're going to use our 30 blade. We sprayed it down with some cool loop so it's nice and cool. Uh, we're just going to do this pad and get all that fur out of there for starters. When I do the pads, I, I don't like to dig too hard, especially if the pad is a little irritated, so I kind of use the corners of the blade to just tip, tip that hair out, just kind of do little, little love taps there. in there and what I like to do is just kind of grab the nail here with this my middle finger and I can spread the pad a little bit better really get in there and same thing on this side I really want to try to clear out all of that hair in the pad because it's holding in all that moisture so yeah so we're just spreading the pad and getting all of that hair that's deep down in there uh, because as we said that that hair is just holding in all that moisture in there and it's causing it to uh, to stay irritated um, so when we clear it out what we're gonna do is in the bathtub we're gonna Definitely get our shampoo in there, medicated shampoo, an anti-itch, or maybe even an aloe, or a oatmeal even. Um, but just wanna show you the importance of keeping these pads nice and clear uh, so that you're not having this problem because unless you get that hair out of there, it's just gonna cause more and more irritation. Um, again, uh, we're, we've had some harsh winters up here in Jersey, so it could just be the result of some salt. Um, or again it could just be an allergy she probably should be seen by a vet just to see what's going on but for today we're just going to give her a little temporary relief by clearing out that pad and cleaning it up a little bit it'll definitely give her some temporary relief so just wanted to show you that real quick guys um, if you see this on your dog uh, definitely that's the answer and uh, if it's depending on how bad it is she may need to be seen by a vet. She's definitely biting at her paws. Um, you know, Pad was a little irritated, so we cleared all that out. Uh, give her some temporary relief. Really wanted to uh, just point out that uh, this is a common occurrence here, especially if you're living in North Jersey, got a lot of debris on the ground, a lot of salt on the ground. It's not uncommon, uh, but if you do see this, uh, definitely uh, take a look at the pads, inspect the pads, uh, very, very important. Uh, thanks again for tuning in, guys. Don't forget to like us on Facebook. Follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Check out our radio show. It's called Groomer Humor. We're going to leave that link down below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks again for tuning in, guys.